This is for Piano Safari 2 in our technique book, the non-spiral bound one. Um, we're actually going to be looking at a number of the um, techniques here right in a row just to make sure we've got them. The tree frog, what it's talking about is making sure we have nice firm fingertips. That means our fit hands need to stay above the keys, not just melting into them. And we need to make sure our thumb is nice and relaxed and that we are counting out the beat with our wrists. So the reason we call this the tree frog is that our fingers stay sticky without being um, hard and we're bouncing out the melody, but like a tree frog, we kind of stay stuck to the keys. All right, so this is on page six. I'll do it in the key of C, and then as you see on here, I want it in all four keys, and so which you can find on page seven, and so um, I'll also do it in the key of A, which includes one black note, which is the C sharp. All right, here's the tree frog. same tall giraffe that we've talked about before and we'll talk about again. Here it is in A. I'm going to set myself up for success by making sure both of my wrists are here. Now you're going to notice this wrist happens to be at kind of an angle, but that's just to stay out of the way of the camera. Actually here, that's better, isn't it? <laughs> okay, now I'm set up better. grasshopper. That staccato is different because we want to make sure we're bouncy, but our arm still stays aligned with all of the notes, okay? We still has, have those nice firm fingertips, which we can't do if we're using the um, that part of our finger. We need that nice firm fingertip, and we're going to make them nice and short. Now, this is written in C, but I'm going to go ahead and do it in G and in D just to kind of show you how we're moving around the piano. So let's do this in G first. Notice how my fingers stay right over the keys. So then I'll do it in D. Shift a little bit for myself. Oh, so sorry. In D, we have an F sharp. are firm but that thumb still stays relaxed kind of on that little edge. With the tall giraffe we want to make sure that our our wrist is nice and loose. It's graceful on those long notes. It's going to lift up. Um, we want to have those same bouncy arms that we did with the tree frog and those same firm fingertips that we always want to make sure we have so that we don't see fingers like this on the keys. Okay. I'll do this one in, how about A and D, since those are a little bit more tricky since they have the, um, the sharp. Here's, here I am in A with my tonic or my first root note on A for both fingers, both hands. Uh, also in 4-4, four, four, so I'll go one, two, three, four. Change keys. Sorry. <laughs> I 
tried to do it in C. And way down here. Notice I still hold the same count. Do each one of those in all four keys, please. <laughs> 